Welcome everyone to HFN, also known as Youth and News. Today is July the 15th, 2021. Take a look at my chart. We're going to give you all the price prediction update in the market XRP. You guys can tell that we've had this prediction on our chart for a very long time and the market continues to trade sideways. We're going to break it down and see if we get any, are we going to receive any price movement upcoming so that we can make sure that we are in position. So if you want to join our team and our community, make sure you hit that like button, share and subscribe. We're not going to here to give you any hype, any FUD, any FOMO. We just want to make sure that we are that we get in position so that we can capitalize on the price movement, whether the price goes higher, whether the price goes lower. We will be in position so that we can dominate this cryptocurrency space and fill our bags. So if you want to join us, the doors are open. So real quick, July the 10th was the last time we did our video in XRP, which was right here. Okay, and let me zoom in on the chart so everyone can see it. You guys can see July the 10th was right here and we still played a weakness into the market in XRP. And for the most part, it is what it is, right? We, we've seen some weakness, but it's only been very minor. It hasn't had a negative impact on the overall price in XRP. It takes us all the way back since July the 2nd of when we created this prediction. And you guys can tell that the market does not always go to certain price levels quickly. Sometimes it takes a while. Sometimes the market continues to slowly move lower or even slowly move higher in price. That is what we call timing. And that is one of the hardest things to do in these cryptocurrency markets as well as the stock market the timing aspect is very difficult so one of the best outliers that we can see is just to be in position if we're anticipating price movement to go lower we just need to make sure that we get in position to capitalize on that move rather than trying to time it so let me look at this chart for xrp on a further out time frame right just to see we got a little bit more weakness involved or can we anticipate to see more movement to the downside? And so far, yeah, the market in XRP is weak. But again, I don't see too much weakness in this particular space. It seems as if the market is complacent with trading around that 63, 65 cent price. The only up bar that we receive over the last couple of three day price bars is right there that I got the arrow pointed down to right there on July the 9th. That was the only time that XRP saw price close higher than the previous three day price bar. So it kind of tells you the overall sentiment of the market just by looking at the three day price bars. Because if the market truly was giving us a lot more strength, we would have seen many of these three three day price bars close higher than the previous one. But we're not even seeing that. So let me go ahead and see the chart for XRP on the two day. And this is the market here in XRP on the two day. Now, a positive thing that I'm seeing on the two day time frame is this. Take a look at this. Right, right there. So 60 cents is being created as a pretty good area of support. Now, seeing that we're trading around 63 or 61 cents into the market in XRP, it won't be a bad thing to try to come through and take some of that profit off the table from when we created this original prediction because we're seeing how the trap is trying to continue to hold price above 60 cents. That literally means that the market can bounce from there just like what we're seeing right now on this current two day price bar and see the market in XRP go higher. You need to be prepared for those things. Now let me see it on the five day. This is the five day time frame. Currently, yeah, we're seeing some weakness into the market in XRP. So all in all, nothing much has changed in the environment in XRP. Over our last two videos that we've done for XRP, nothing has changed. The market is still harnessing some weakness. Now, one thing I will do, though, is I would take this profit off the table, though, because that 60 cent area that I just mentioned is literally showing me that the market is willing to prop up price there. So while we have profits, we need to go ahead and take some of that off. So let's do it. So it's only about 4.46%, but it's profitability. It's an increase of what we came into the game with. We're walking out as victories or victorious, right? So let me go ahead and take that away. 4.46% right there. Overall, you guys can tell that the trend in XRP was broken though. So the overall environment in XRP is weakness. So what I'm going to do, seeing how the market in XRP has broken the overall long-term trend, 
we need to take this line to where we can utilize it to our benefit okay and literally it goes all the way back here okay goes all the way back here to November 25th 2020 that was the last time this particular price hit 70 cents as restriction and you guys can see the outcome it came back down we broke through 70 cents on April the 5th 2021 for a small stint came back down tested it on May 23rd 2021 price moved higher then we broke right back down below 70 cents on June 21st 2021 so overall the market in XRP is weak garnering and seeing visually that this price cannot break above 70 cents so I don't care what anyone tells you until we see the price in XRP break above 70 cents the market is going to continue to trade sideways for one and then two we're going to see the price go lower it's just that easy just that simple the trap is dropping evidence to us every trading day that we can utilize so that is it we're seeing the market in XRP trade within the channel right now so let me extend this out so this is the weekly time frame right here in XRP we're in a downtrend I just wanted to show forth that because looking at this on a weekly chart 60 cents can't hold you know where the next area support is going to be right back down 50 so I just wanted to show you like an area of view on a longer out time frame as to where the market support can be maintained in XRP under the premise that we can't hold 60 it's going to be 50 cents okay this is the two weeks time frame we got three days and 15 hours left on this current uh, two weekly price bar and we're still seeing ideally that the market in XRP is still weak and right now there's just no indication that the market wants to go higher in price on none of these price bars right so let's see if we could get a small bounce into the market in XRP I'm looking at this on 11 hour time frame and so far I'm still seeing indications of market weakness this is the five hour again still seeing some weakness involved into the market in XRP the only thing that's positive is seeing the fact that the market is able to prop up price above 60 cent that's the only positive thing without that 60 cent ever being seen as support we would have seen the market in XRP completely fall out and move lower but so far the trap is sustaining that ability to try to continue to at least maintain price now it's not overly strong we're not overly seeing the volume come through on that 60 cent support area but it shows forth that someone into the market is appreciating XRP trading around 60 cents okay so let me do this here we're going to go ahead and play the weakness again in the market in XRP now I'm here to tell you 70 cents into the market in XRP that's when the overall environment has changed for the space meaning the market is is really showing forth interest and demand that price will go higher in price right so that's our ultimate restriction point right there but the next closest area of restriction to where the price currently is is 65 so both of those areas will be acting as restriction we need to anticipate the market to come back down because selling is going to start on those particular price levels 65 and then 70 cents okay now we have to be very careful okay because like I told you earlier in the video the trap is trying to hold 60 cents so that is kind of a, a risk that you have to play into the market because we already understand that the support area into the market in XRP is at 60. So even though we're anticipating the market to try to break that to the downside, we still need to be on guard because seeing this market hold support in XRP on 60 cent, we need to eradicate this prediction as soon as possible so that we can minimize those losses. That's why I told you 65 cents will be the first area. If we break 65 cents in XRP, then again, we're going to test that upper restriction area of 70 cents in the long term. Right? And when I transition over from the hourly time frame, I'm still seeing how the market is trying to prop up price. 
okay so let's do it let me take it back over to the daily <clears throat> and we're gonna play that right there okay we're gonna play just like it is um, I'm not really seeing too much volatility though I'm not seeing too much price action coming through into the market in XRP probably overall in the cryptocurrency space just pretty much seeing us bouncing between these two lines these two lines what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take this down here further since we're expecting us to try to test the lows that came in on June 22nd and June 23rd okay so that's pretty much where I'm expecting the price to go in XRP over the next couple of days so now we're in position we're gonna play this this is where we're expecting the market to go now it's your turn I mean I want you all to tell me what do you all see on this particular price chart for XRP where are we headed we need to get there as a community as a team we need to make sure that we get in position so that we can win against the trap the trap is right there on the bottom left side of my screen we need to beat him because he's trying to take the money from everyone else we need to try to take it right back so I want you all to tell me in the comment section where do you all think the price for XRP is going to go again remember that price support is at 60 cents so with this prediction already on the table showing forth the weakness I'm not going to be fooled into thinking that the price can go higher because it can especially as we're seeing this market hold 60 cents so keep that in mind questions comments let us know make sure you maintain the profitability and again I'll see you all on the next one